chemistry club here at, on uh, William Patterson campus. Uh, they're going to do some science experiments for us. So uh, it's Kelly Moran and Janine Almalel. Yep. There you go. <laughs> so what are, we, what are we doing today? Okay, so there's a couple things we're going to be doing. One of them involves liquid nitrogen. I know everybody loves to freeze things and, you know, all that kind of fun stuff. And then the other one involves acetone, both which can be harmful, but it's okay because ah. we're professionals. <laughs> <laughs> We're all professionals. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do, uh, Janine's actually going to take care of it. Okay. Okay. We've got the liquid nitrogen here. Ooh. It's actually uh, 77 degrees Kelvin, so super, super cold. And just put the balloon in. We're sponsored by ShopRite. <laughs> so, Kelly, do you want to take out the balloon yeah. out for me? So. What? I can touch this? Yeah, it's a little chilly. You can boop it around if you want. <laughs> and that's a technical term. Boop it? Boop it around. Ooh, whoa. <laughs> I don't know if it's something. No, no, no. Ah! <laughs> oh, that's really Did you cool. Do you want to try it? That is awesome. Ooh, yeah. yeah. So what happens with the liquid nitrogen, uh, when you <laughs> place the balloon inside of liquid nitrogen, it, um, the temperature, well, the balloon like gets smaller. This means um, yeah. the temperature decreases as well, and the balloon gets smaller. And as the uh, temperature decreases, volume decreases. Yep. That's crazy. So pretty much what happens in like your tires in the winter, and you have to keep going and getting them refilled with air. Yeah. Pain in the butt it is, but at least this one's fun. I must say I'm a little concerned that you guys are wearing gloves and we're not wearing gloves. <laughs> <laughs> it's totally And lab though. coats, you know? It's Gla okay. Gloggles, you know what I mean. Yeah. If you were to actually take this right now and just dump it, it wouldn't actually be a liquid. It wouldn't go on the ground. It would sit there and it would just, like, Bubble up. poof into That's air. <laughs> like, kind of like Terminator 2. You just, yeah. like, freeze and then just, like, <laughs> you're exactly back at it like yeah. <laughs> Then we gotta hit you with the hammer and you're just, like, crumble. Crack apart. <laughs> Can we try that? <laughs> Giuseppe! <laughs> Okay, so do you want to do that? So the next thing is, if one of you guys wants to hold this, all right. So just dip it in. Actually, if you want, just do you want to dip oh, it in the yeah. acetone? Here we go. Good luck, Eric. Dip in time. Oh my! What? Don't try this at home, kids. What? <laughs> so what happens, Kelly? Okay, so um, with styrofoam, it's mostly <laughs> air. It's actually uh, the polymer is breaking down. So when they break down, all the air escapes. So if you want, what's really cool actually. That is crazy. So now gently pour that into the cup. Oh my god. Just a little bit. So the cup. Whoa. <laughs> no more cup. That is crazy. And you can sit there and just keep on putting it in like this. <laughs> and if you keep pushing it down, it just keeps on going. That is That's so amazing. cool, Kelly. You could put like all of it. Put this whole bucket in there. Actually, yeah, you would. I wouldn't want the liquid nitrogen going on the floor, oh, no, but. <laughs> I, I do not blame you at all. That is insane. Yeah, and just all of it's gonna be gone. And does it like, when there's enough styrofoam in it, will it stop doing it, or will you just, it just keep going until? Well, it's... what's cool is, since it is mostly air, mm -hmm. um, instead of it being this big, all the air escapes, so you get like only like a teeny tiny little bit of styrofoam. Mm -hmm. And just all the air just goes away. It's, yeah, it's go like, ahead. It's, like, it's very pungent. Yeah, this, is, try um, again? this is almost as fast as my Uncle Barry eats corn. <laughs> <laughs> you, you don't even have an Uncle Barry. Right? I don't. <laughs> that is so cool. Just 45 minutes of just <laughs> 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 yeah. Well, Well, thank you. This is insane. This is the coolest thing that I think we've done so no far. No problem. Anytime. Uh, <laughs> I'd like to thank Kelly and Janine for coming on the show. Uh, <laughs> we'll be right back with Late Night. <laughs> My thanks to Daniel Patrick Sheridan, Kelly Moran, Janine Almanac, Manuel, the Chemistry Club, and uh, our house for the State of the Union. Uh, thanks for watching. Good night. Thank you.